What's going on guys? James here at Claw Gaming. We are going to be doing a little unboxing of the DJI mic. I'm probably a little bit late on the hype train for this mic system, but I finally pulled the trigger on it. It's actually going to be replacing my shotgun mic that I've been using for my vlogs and certain videos on my YouTube channel. Um, the reason why I wanted to switch over to a lav system or a wireless mic system is that when I have my shotgun mic on my camera and I want to vlog or if I want to flip the camera around to record something else, then obviously the mic is directional and you won't be able to hear me. So that's why I'm switching over to a wireless mic system. I'm going to be having this directly on me, probably most of the time that I'm vlogging or doing a video. And I just want to be able to manipulate the camera as I'm holding it, flip it around, take different shots, and just do a lot of voiceovers and cinematics and things like that. Uh, the mic that I've been using is a video go to, I believe. I'll have it linked in the description down below so you guys can look at it. And I have pictures on my Twitter and my Instagram of what the camera system currently looks like. Um, I will also be doing some other setup videos and things like that on how to make sure you're getting the right options and settings for the DJI mic onto your camera and make sure all the audio stuff is all synced up properly and you're not hitting or peaking uh, on the audio system itself. But anyways, as you can see here, we're already unboxing the DJI mic system. I was actually surprised of how small this thing is. Uh, when I was watching other people's videos the past maybe year or two and I've been looking at them at a new mic system I, I am thoroughly impressed on how minimal and how like how compact it is especially for two two uh, two receivers are um, So you, oh no two transmitters sorry you get two transmitters and one receiver one receiver goes on to either the cold shoe or a quarter inch mount on camera and then you have two receivers for either one is a backup one is going to be on two people so you have a left and right channel recording and vice versa and pretty much a like an interview go like a, yeah like an interview go system so you have one mic you'll have on yourself and then one is a backup or one to give to this, a second talent so i like how i like how dji does all their boxes it's almost like an apple experience you pull the tab open the box Lid has everything listed that should be in the box, and then you get a nice little carrying bag to fit it all in. So the DJI mic system comes in that little textured case, almost like a plastic, a, a nice hard plastic with a, a nice little finish on it. And then so this one actually comes with the upgraded 3.5 millimeter jack, uh, the original, the original three and a half jack. Uh, was was giving interference, a little buzzing noise, so they, they determined it was the right angle connector on there. So they started shipping it with this straight connection, which I believe solved the issues. Um, I haven't personally tested it yet, but from the videos and things that I've seen before, it looks like they did go to from, from a version 1 cable, 90 degree bend to just a straight, straight uh, three and a half inch jack. Um, here's your manuals here. That's gonna be all available online as well. So you, I don't know why they still in include these. I don't know if it's by law or if it's just just manufacturers things. You can always scan a QR code and go directly to the website. Um, I usually just either toss these away or put them in the recycling. But this is the charging case, neatly wrapped. And as I was saying, it's a it's a very hefty case. It, it allows you to keep. The whole system charged up for probably about uh let's say so the transmitters themselves can probably go a whole day like six or seven hours maybe depending on how much you're using them you pop them in the charger real quick and it's pretty much gonna last you a, maybe a week or longer depending how much rec you record or how you vlog but um I can't wait to start using this system. Um, I'm not using it just yet because I'm still making videos about this product. Um, the, disclaimer, I, the DJI didn't send this to me. This is something I purchased with my own money. So this is just my raw reaction to it. The case is really nice. It's small and compact, a little bit hefty. It's almost like a battery bank at that point. Um, it, it fits pretty much anywhere that I need it to. Uh, it has a nice clamshell. A nice satisfying click when you open and close it. You have three, uh, you have four LEDs in the front showing you, of course, 
the battery percentage of the charging case. And then when you flip it open, everything turns on. So the, the lights on the receiver will give you the battery indicator on left and right side or transmitter one, transmitter two. And then the middle battery indicator will be the battery of the your your receiver, sorry. And then the two little attachments in the back over there is gonna be for your iPhone or a USB-C for your Android or any USB-C enabled or lightning enabled audio device. And these are the transmitters. So you do have a little dead cat that comes with it. These things are a little bit finicky. You just have to line up the slots and then twist. Uh, it took me a couple of times to figure out how to fully connect it, but once once you get in there, you feel a satisfying click. And as soon as you open the case and pull one of the mics out, pretty much, it's gonna start transmitting that audio to the receiver. So you do have a standard clip to either pin it to, or clip it onto like a shirt or a jacket or a certain item. If you're, if you're 3D printing a mic stand, you can clip it onto that. And then the little square magnet is to just plop it onto pretty much anything and everything so it's really useful and fun so right now i'm just pulling out the receiver and it's just going to automatically know that i pulled it out of the charging case and it will give me options of starting the setup process um, I, this product has been out for quite some time already so i'm not going to go through every single piece of the settings and things like that um, it, unless you guys want me to i'll come back to it and do a video but there's, there's a lot of videos out there already on this mic system and I'm sure I'm just going to pretty much maybe keep it at default settings or maybe change some gain settings and then just let it run and just change the audio input on my camera. So I'll be using this on my a7C. And then we'll be moving on over to the MVL. This is going to be the... Uh, your lavalier or lavalier yeah pretty much your, your lav mic <laughs> um I, I was stuck between a couple of different options so there's the sure one and then there's the road and then there is the i think the sennheiser one that i was looking at but because of the issues in the past with the with the noise interference i i looked at so many youtube videos for like hours and hours of different comparisons of which lavalier to use, or which lavi, which lav has less um, audio audio inter interference? Um, but I, I've used, I use a lot of Sure products now, so I kind of I'm almost like brand loyal. Right now, I'm using to record this voice over the uh, the Sure uh, SM7B, and then I'm using my IEMs, which is the Sure SC215s. I always love Shure's uh, packaging and just carrying cases. It's a nice leatherette carrying case. And then it's pretty much just uh, the love that's in that pouch. Uh, I did open it before just to make sure everything was okay. Your standard three and a half uh, TRRS, I believe, is the three, the three ring one. And then you have your lapel clip or just your love clip. And then it has this little tiny um, mic foam that goes around the system itself. And then just your standard three and a half inch jack. So I, I'll be using that in tandem with the DJI mic so that I can just run and gun with my A7C and not worrying, not having to worry about where and when the camera is pointed. But overall, this is just going to be a quick unboxing of the DJI mic and the Shure MVL. Um, I will have audio stuff in the future, so stay tuned, guys.